Hi, Mr. Kumia. Sounds like they want you to move you. Okay, waiting for me to talk about my problems. Excellent. So one time when I was 13, my uh, VHS got chewed up in this VHS playing and made me very depressed and really upset at me. And he, they fixed it. The, he fixed the tape and just wind it up. And, um, when I was a day old, day after my birth, I had this rattle. It was a starfish rattle. <laughs> and, uh, I remember loving the rattle. He was one of my favorite rattles as far as I remember. I love to like I love movies. Um so uh Damn. I'm tired and sad. I made myself sad. Mm, just lost this, my eyes at G for some reason. Um, trying to get too sad. I think I'm doing a pretty old king job. And, um, so, you remember Benny? Well, Benny wanted me to call Uncle Finn on the day of my birth and the next day, too. He kept on trying to, me to say Uncle Benny. Even after he blew some smoke in my face and I coughed a little, and he's just like, Uncle Benny. And I threw my rat away him. And I think they, they tried to strangle me. And mom told Vinny to stop that. And Vinny stopped. I was surprised that actually worked. I thought I was going to be gone now. Oftentimes, Vinny abused me. I thought I was going to be a goner. Like, this was going to be it. And... I got distracted. I'm feeling my brain because my brain's healing. And, um, so anyway, I, I asked mom if we could get my rattle, and I thanked her. I asked if we could get my rattle. And she says, oh no, it's, it's dirty. And I said, okay, mom, well, uh, can you close the, the, uh, 
the camera so I can cry alone. And when he came back, he called Linda, told Linda to stop, and tell Linda she forgot something. And it was my rattling. I thank Benny and said I'm said I'm sorry I thought you were such an asshole. And he, then uh, he he slammed the rattle on the floor and then stepped on the rattle and broke it. I don't know how many times, but anyway. And we quiet and I scream, rattle, 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 rattle. No, rattle, rattle. So I just miss it. I know I didn't like to have it that long, but you know, sometimes when you love something so much, and you don't have it that that much of a long time. It's it's easy to it sometimes hurts more. One time I had a big dog. Um. Uh, I watched Ben 10. This was in 2005. I watched the pilot to Ben 10 and didn't know what it was, but I knew I was liking it. When I was with his mom, I um, didn't really got to watch that much TV or why well, I, I got to watch a lot of TV, but I didn't get to watch a lot of movies. Well, I didn't. I kind of had. I didn't get to watch a lot, lot of TV like I wanted to. Maybe because Vinny was abusing me most of the time, and the same goes for watching movies and stuff. Yeah. One time in 2007, when I was playing the Spider-Man, the way I told you, so we were to play the Spider-Man game all day long, freaked out and told me to never ever play that game, play same room, playing video games all day again. So, um, sometime when I'm 10, um, I meet this kid, uh, Connor, called Connor Stewart, who is a big Ben 10 fan. And I basically got into watching Ben 10 because of him, because I wanted to know all the stuff he was talking about because I was kind of very interested. He got me interested. And by the time I get called caught up, he leaves his Columbus, I mean, Lighthouse School. And I, I can't sleep, it's 
I'm sorry, I've got distractions from something happy in my memories right now. I'm sorry I can remember. Bye.